the solar system. An eight-planet system consisting of a total of eight planets and one star. But have you ever wondered when and how our solar system formed? And most importantly, why are the first four planets in the solar system rocky, while the other four are all gas giants? If you're interested in learning all about the history of our solar system and having all your questions about our cosmic journey answered, please stay with us until the end of the video. Also, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel to support us. If we want to understand exactly how the solar system came into existence, we need to travel back 5 billion years. A location in the central arm of the Milky Way galaxy, which is located at a distance of 25,000 light years from its center. At that time, our solar system was just a cloud of gas and dust rotating rapidly around itself. This rotation continued until, at its center, due to the accumulation of excessive amounts of hydrogen gas, a young star was born, named the Sun. As you know, a star forms from the accumulation of a large amount of gas and its compression over millions of years. Due to the high pressure in the star's core, hydrogen undergoes nuclear fusion and transforms into helium and heavier elements. If you're interested in learning more about the life cycle of stars from birth to death, watch the video that appears in the top right corner for you. When the sun was newly born, and dust and gas were still swirling around it due to solar winds, lighter elements like hydrogen and helium were pushed backward, while heavier elements remained closer to the sun's core. When this dust and gas were swirling around the sun, microscopic particles were attracted to each other by the gravitational force between them, forming larger particles. Over millions of years, the accumulation of microscopic particles increased, and more dust and gas were drawn towards its center. After millions of years, the first planets emerged, spanning thousands of miles in radius. Our solar system finally took shape after 500 million years, with a diameter of 18.6 trillion miles, and began its own life. It's fascinating to know that at one point, our beautiful planet had a diameter only as large as a microscopic particle, whereas today it has a diameter of 12,600 kilometers. Now the question arises as to why the planets close to the Sun, namely the first four planets, are rocky, while the next four planets are all gas giants. As I mentioned before, Due to the collision of solar winds with the dust and gas around it, lighter elements were pushed backward, and heavier elements remained closer to the Sun. The heavier elements formed the rocky planets, Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. The lighter elements, such as hydrogen and helium that were pushed farther back, formed the gas giants, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. These gas giants are mostly composed of gas elements, accounting for about 70% of their composition, while only 30% consists of metallic elements, mostly in their small cores. Until 2006, scientists believed that the solar system consisted of nine planets. However, according to a definition introduced by the International Astronomical Union, the ninth planet, Pluto, no longer qualified as a planet, and it was removed from the list of solar system planets. Instead, it's now recognized only as a dwarf planet. If you're interested in making a video about the formation of each planet in the solar system, be sure to write it in the comments section for us. Please, if you have enjoyed watching this video so far, like it to support us. Also, share it with your friends. If you're interested in understanding what existed before the Big Bang and how it came into being, watch the video that appears on the right side of the screen for you.